making a good recovery and hopes to pick up his whistle next season, all being well. Let's get on to the weather. Is some good news on the weather then? Well, we've got a lot of cloud around and there's limited brightness, but the good news is it should be mainly dry this week, bar some rain on Friday. Martin Curtis took this photo of the girls during last night's sunset at Western Shore in Southampton. And here we have a mandarin duck on the pond in Fritham and New Forest. Hayley Wolvin, thank you. And Barry Webb captured a fox taking full advantage of the warmth of his neighbour's roof in Stubbington. So we did see some sunny spells today, but there was generally a lot of cloud and we hold on to that cloud cover overnight tonight, where we do have a few clear spells, patchy frost and also fog may form, particularly out in the countryside. There, temperatures may fall to freezing or just below. But in our towns and cities, we're looking at lows of three to five Celsius. So in most places above freezing. A cloudy start to the day tomorrow, mainly dry start. Where the cloud is thickest, there is the chance we could have the odd spot of light rain and drizzle. Temperatures up to around 5 to 7 Celsius, very similar to what they were today. And with light winds in any bright or sunny spells, it will feel fairly pleasant. Temperatures around their seasonal average, if not just below. So a lot of cloud to end the day tomorrow. It's a repeat performance tomorrow night. Patchy drizzle is a possibility, as it's clear skies in a few places. But generally, lots of cloud across the board and temperatures will fall to around 2 to 5 Celsius. As we look ahead to Thursday, it should be a mainly dry day. It's a repeat performance of today and tomorrow a fair amount of cloud we do have a weather system moving in it's an area of low pressure now there's a lot of uncertainty about this area of low pressure and there has been for much of this week but we are expecting it to move in Thursday night and into Friday and it will perhaps produce some rain through Thursday night and through Friday daytime, lasting until Saturday morning. So once that rain clears on Saturday morning, the weekend should be largely dry, but there will be a fair amount of cloud with maybe one or two bright and sunny spells. So the sunshine a little hard to find this week. There's a lot of cloud about, but the winds are fairly light up until Friday when the area of low pressure pushing in from the Atlantic may produce outbreaks of rain through the day. As I said, a lot of uncertainty about that area of low pressure as to where the centre of it will move to but do stay tuned to the forecast because we will update you over the next few days. A lot of cloud over the next few days. Patchy drizzle is a possibility tomorrow, but the weekend should be mainly dry, still cloudy, one or two bright spells, perhaps some rain first thing on Saturday. Sally. Thanks, Alexis. That's it from us. More at 8 and then our extended news, of course, at 10.25. We're back here tomorrow at half past six. Thanks for watching tonight. Be with us tomorrow if you can. Good night. Good night. Good night.